for three weeks. With the 1903 Springfield rifle, Marines learned the fundamentals of marksmanship. And when Marines were first put into the line on June 4th, 1918, Marines started hitting Germans from four football fields away. The Germans knew they were up against someone different. Every Marine, a rifleman, would become part of our ethos for the next hundred years. Shoot one, shoot one! <laughs> There really is no such thing as advanced marksmanship. There's no secret skill, there's no cheat code. It isn't Call of Duty. It's extreme applications of the fundamentals. Uh, all we do is we add more stress on top of that. When these people come out, they're in uncharted territory. So they get to learn something about themselves. How fast can they adapt? How fast can they learn a new skill and apply it towards mission accomplishment? So we run a uh, two-week package for the shooters. We roll them into three days of training courses where they go over different positional work and they go over weapons transitions and shooting on the move. Those three days of training are geared more towards uh, the action dynamic style of shooting. But the second week uh, of the program uh, is our individual match and our team match stages. So what we do is we set up a course. It's kind of like a, a big puzzle that they have to figure out. Uh, we give them a few ground rules, a few safety rules, and then we tell them that you need to shoot these targets however you see fit in the fastest amount of time as possible with the accuracy that is necessary. Marines have to problem solve, uh, they have to deal with weapons malfunctions on the clock, and they have to deal with the stress of competition. You'll probably see them moving in and out, walls, barricades, they shoot through low ports. We put different aspects into the stage that we want to test them on, that we have trained them on before. So they will see nothing that they're not prepared for, uh, but it will be in a very condensed, stressful environment.